A retreat by France's first family. President Nicolas Sarkozy's son Jean has dropped his bid to take charge of the agency running the country's top business district. It's a difficult decision that I take in all conscience, but I can't accept that there is any hint of favoritism or of preferential treatment. The 23-year-old has had a dazzling political career. In less than two years rising from law student to an elected councillor of Neuilly, a wealthy suburb where his father was once the mayor. Then he quickly came to lead the right-wing majority in the district's regional council. The leftist opposition greeted this step back by Jean Sarkozy as a minor victory. We welcome them back peddling. I think they finally understood that it wasn't a good idea. Sarkozy Jr.'s bid to manage EPAD made even some members of his party uncomfortable. His decision was welcomed. It's good that this is the outcome, because I find a lot of attention has been devoted to the situation. I think he acted with dignity and that he was the target of extremely violent attacks. The way in which he spoke about the situation showed his maturity. But the man dubbed Prince Jean by the press hasn't gone home empty-handed. While he's no longer in the running to be president of EPAD, he was elected to its board on Friday. Like father, like son, the younger Sarkozy is likely to remain a political force in the future. <laughs>